Hello everybody, this is Mad Marshman, and welcome to another episode of our vanilla survival world, <coughs> the Night Garden. And as you can see, our water is very blue. We're not running Optifine, because we are running Snapshot 13W19A. But as you can see, high definition texture packs would run fine with the new launcher, but we have no minimap and no Optifine. So, let's get on. First thing we're going to do is we've taken nine stacks of iron from the golem farm chest and we're going to make our first nine blocks of iron. 64 blocks of iron, sorry. A full stack. That can go in the ender chest. Let's get these here. And uh, my skelly spawner in 1.5 and 1.51 and 1.52, no rare drops. Put it on the snapshot, and it's working as it should do. These are rare drops from the skellies. I got, a, and these are the sort of skellies you don't want to meet with bows like this. I had a punch one bow, and I put it on the power four bow we used to kill the dragon. I meant to show you it. So I'd done my normal trick of putting it on the anvil to see how much it would cost and then taking the finished product out rather than taking out the unfinished. Now we see gold armoured skelly. Stand back. I don't really want the items. I don't want to clutter up my inventory any more than necessary. There's one way of doing this. You do this and then run in and all we pick up is arrows unless of course you wanted anything else well we got 31 alright back upstairs up we go yeah this new snapshot is running fine frame rates are really good so we're gonna suffer not having our mini map, so it means I'm more than likely going to get lost and see how we get on into our enchanted library. Infinity, right? Let's just make room for that. I know we have millions of arrows, but I want to put infinity on the bow because I want to go for a little walk and I don't want to be carrying an inventory full of arrows with me. So the arrows can go in this clutter chest. We'll keep ten on us because even with infinity we need at least one arrow. No we don't want to be on there, we want to be on here. Infinity. Fifteen levels. We have 16 levels. We've still got our projectile protection 2 and thorns 2, but I think that's over 30 levels to repair that. We'll just have a quick look. That can go there. This in here. 29 levels, which we don't have and I can't be bothered to wait for. So that can go back in. There's something else I wanted to do that I've never done in vanilla Minecraft before. I've done it in survival maps. And that is make some golden apples. Never used them before, but skellies are so powerful now. And that's we're going for a little walk. I thought we'll try some, see how we get on. So they can go back in there. Gold can go back. Put the nugget in there as well. Got our bags packed. I think we've got what we need. Food, tools, big block of iron, some diamonds, some wood. Yeah, let's not dwell on it anymore no idea what time of day it is. Night time clearly. 
So with the new snapshot we've got the coal block, we have a bale of hay, we have horses. We're not actually going looking for a horse but if we find one we aren't going to turn it down. And more importantly dungeons now have lots of new loot and lots of loot apparently. So I believe we want to go north because I don't think I've been too far that way. So we want to generate some new terrain. Alright, let's increase the frame rate. Excuse me. That's a little bit smoother. If you run on maximum frame rate, game plays lovely until you start to record mm -hmm. and then it's all a bit flickery. So I think a reduced frame rate will play and helps the recording a little bit. That's where Optifine does help you out no end. But we've not got that option at the moment, so we aren't going to have it. So I've obviously been through here because we've got torches. These vines are annoying me. So let's see what we can find. I may cut the record and if it gets too boring. I don't really want to drop into any of these caves because I think they're all we've had these before. Let's get some food into us. We should have brought some speed potions. This would have aided us a little bit. I don't really want to hit ocean if I can help it, but that's not my choice. Well, we've got a massive jungle coming up. Yeah, as you've been watching this, I've recorded quite a few episodes in front, so... Right, that sounded distinctly like a dungeon. No, it's a zombie bird there. Zombie villager with an egg. Oh, I got all excited then, I thought we were going to be into our first dungeon. As I was saying, I'm a few episodes in front, but as you're watching this, Desert Temple, you will already see that I've released Ah, oh, clay. See, I can't keep the sentence going. We've got the new stained, hardened clay blocks as well. Um, I've released a few episodes of Game Dev Tycoon, and that really doesn't seem to be going down very well, but never mind. It's fun to play, and we're going to support some game developers, independent game developers, so maybe we'll try something else. Yeah, I've only been getting really small amount of views on that, but I'll probably put up a few episodes because, I, as I do with Minecraft, I recorded several episodes at once. Because that's the easy way to play. Right, let's go and see what we can find in here and clutter up our inventory before we even get anywhere. interesting looking temple with the vines growing on it anyway. Well we know how these work, we've got vines indoors as well. Any mobs in here to greet us? Doesn't look like it. Right, in we go. Not quite that directly. So we all know these are trapped. We've all seen that before. Mind you, even though I knew they were trapped, the first one I went in, I fell in. Somehow. We should be able to take that out without setting off the TNT. We can. Alright. Bones. Gold. Why not? I'm looking for something more interesting. 
I don't know if we want a dog or not. As you can see, we're leaving the iron behind. That's, um, that is the way we are now. Right, nothing in there really of any interest to us. Chiseled sandstone. We'll keep one of them. Just for the hell of it. Right, out we go again. Well, we found a landmark, if nothing else. Right, which way? North. Nice big desert. Still haven't... Yep. Still haven't got any silk touch touch shears, which is slightly annoying. Not even got a silk touch book. Yep, where are you? Can hear lava. And lots of zombies clearly. Are we gonna be into our first spawner? Louder. Where are you coming from? Leave ourselves a big hole for a creeper to drop in with us. I hope he's burning in lava and not in daylight, because if he's in daylight that means he's above us. Definitely enjoying that lava. Are they below us? Mm, creeper. Right. Right, is it a dungeon or just a cave? We brought plenty of level one enchanted picks, and that's something I forgot to bring. I was going to bring our enchanting table with us. I knew I'd forget something. You could be very annoying. first dungeon. Clearly we haven't. Oh well. We had a look. Sandstone. Yeah, why not? We didn't get very far before I lost which way was north. Yep, that way. Quite a large desert. Nice to find one of them surface spawners. I mentioned them before. Every time I watch anyone else's LP, there's a nice big square hole in the ground. There's a spawner. Oh, look, there's another spawner. But it doesn't seem to happen for me. Is that a I don't know what that is, I was going to call that a ravine, but I think it's just a crack. There's a better way to describe that. Is this a cave or a lighting glitch? Lighting glitch. Right, let's keep going this way. Do I bother? I'm going to.
Just you? Have you got any friends? You have at least one friend. If I can hear him. How are we for health? Right. Does this go anywhere? No. Come on. I'm sure my viewers would like to see something more interesting than this. Right, night time is upon us. Goody good. Let's sort that out right quick. Hop in here. Now we need silk touch. And we're going to have to throw something away, which is most definitely going to be zombie flesh. And my amazing sense of direction tells me that that is north. Off we go again. There's a creeper. Spider should be relatively friendly. Oh, big chunk error. Mind you, the world's loading in reasonably quick, I suppose, considering we're just running. I haven't got an over beasty computer, that's quite reasonable, but it's definitely not a beast. Alright. I'm not used to all these muddy banks, I'm used to my Optifine joined textures, which is nice. Alright, let's try our luck here. This could help us. I know they tend to glitch out a lot, but it could also help us if we can counter many mobs. Right, are they coming? Are they going to follow or are they just going to. Yeah. We now got some dogs to bark in our ears continuously. Alright, let's see what dogs do in the snapshot, see if they glitchy as they are in every other version of Minecraft. I can't see a witch hut because I've never encountered one of them before in any of my worlds. A bit swampy and a bit foresty. Them sheep will make a move, otherwise they could lose their lives quite quickly. My dogs are hungry, which means I will have to kill some pigs and not with my fire aspect sword because they won't eat cooked. I don't know if they eat cooked meat or not. I'm still heading north, that's not bad for me. Oh, no. Loads of dogs. A lot of dogs. I want to find something interesting. Oh, surface lava. Vaguely interesting, but... Horses. Now this is very interesting. Very interesting indeed. Sit. Sit. Right, I need an... Let's get some health. Alright. We need... Put one of these down. 
Get rid of some stuff. All this lava and fire is a bit worrying. Where, how far away is that? Let's get the away from the lava. Oh dear, where the whole world's going to catch on fire now we arrived and loaded the chunk. Not towards the lava, please. Cool you are as well, aren't you? You crazy horse. even aiming to get a horse but that gone out yes right where's the one I was attempting to ride how much wheat are you going to eat oh as much as I want to give you right you like me now then right then so oh get out of the fire you stupid dog so now we're going to try something else that I haven't ever done before. So we have... That is two leashes. Let's make quite a few of them because we have quite a few horses to play with here. So where's the one I tamed? That better not have died in a fire. There's horses everywhere here. Where is the brown and white? Where is the brown and white? I tamed a brown and white horse. So not this idiot over by the lava. There he is. I'm sure that's one of them. That other one's going to die. Come on. Good horse. What we really want is a mule. Do I not know how to work this? I do. Right, have we got... I want to cover that lava up, but at the same time I want to keep it there, because that's given us quite a lot of natural light. You're not one of mine, are you? You're just hanging out with the pack. Right. So we have a brown and white one. I can't bear this anymore. I don't want, I don't want to see any of these horses die in this lava, really. Have we got a donkey over here? Or a mule? What have we got? There's horses everywhere. This is ridiculous. Baby horses. Donkey. Alright, that should be enough weight. Have we got a waggy tail. Does that mean anything? He's bucked me off already. And again, he's a wild one. He likes me. We got a lead on him. We have no. Oh, broken lead. Alright. Come on. Come on, donkey. Stop eating. We got a safe route through here. Have I just picked the route of certain death? We'll come this way. He's still eating. Come on. Am 
my lead break? Where did it where did it break? There it is. Come on. He's as stubborn as a mule. Come on, boy. He's on there. Right. Now let's try something different. I think we can... Do we just right-click the donkey with a sad... Oh, and shift and right-click. And our donkey now has an inventory. Superb. I believe I have got some saddles at home. So who's next? Well, we want some different colours, don't we? Because then we could just maybe start a breeding program. You have lots of wheat. You shut up, sit down, sc scaring the horses. Oh, yeah. Oh, we got the hearts. We have got the hearts. Right. Come here. Get on there. Lovely. End a chest. Bed. You can only sleep at night. You are correct. I cannot believe, I mean we didn't come looking for horses, I was more interested in caves, which we still want to find because we want horse armour and name tags and saddles. Let's get this area lit up. We're not that far from home even. Should have should have put a saddle should have put a saddle in the chest. Right, who's missing? Donkey, no, he's still there. Right, let's have a go at one more at least. What colours have we got? So we've got Donkey, Spotty. That's a baby brown one. You need to grow up a little bit. Can we ride you? Are you too small? No, we can ride you. For a little while. We're still on. Come on, boy. Give me the hearts. He's calmed right down. I can hear spiders. That lead broke. There's spiders down there. If that's a spider dungeon, could be happy days. We need a saddle. Now on there, we got enough room. Oh no, they've all broken. Did I just release them all from the post inadvertently? Right, I saw another lead hit the deck somewhere. This is a mess. This is a tangle of leads. Well, there's the lead I lost. Alright, you. Come here. Please. Excellent. Now, was I over here? Listen, here in spiders? We can't ignore this. Oh. Don't be cave spiders. I don't want to die and not... Right, quickly, F3. Screenshot. I don't want to do that just to get the coordinates. Just in case we die. We do not want to lose all these horses. Come on then. Oh, it's open to the world. Hello! This is the only time ever you want a Bane of Arthropods sword.
can't hear any more spiders, so I don't think we've got a spider dungeon here. Unfortunately, unless it's round here and they were spawning out of it. No, and I've now run out of torches. Oh, I have horses dropping in. Stupid horses. Let's get back out of here. Let me up. Right, where are my fine animals? Here they are. Well, there we have it. A donkey and three horses and plenty of others to be tamed. So we'll see what we're going to carry on with from here. So thanks for watching. See you all next time. Bye bye.